For I know the plans I have for you, says the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. Jeremiah 29, 11. It's early. It's like 7.30 in the morning. You know you gotta wake up early, girl, to start your day. I actually do need to start waking up early. I've just been like having trouble like going to bed on time. I'm going to bed really late, especially like last night. Yeah, no, I, I, it's been hard for me to like sleep as well. I have so much on my mind, but I, I watched your video. It was so you cute. Did. I was like, oh my God. Thank I was, like, you. I felt like I was watching a movie and like, I watched it in my bathroom and I was like, I have to get to my TV and I was like, oh my God, this movie, I can't stop watching it. What was your favorite part? Well, my favorite part was when you and the guy were arguing because <laughs> I don't know why, but that to me was so sexy. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'm a little bit toxic. That's Maybe. <laughs> I got issues, girl. That man was fine. Like, he was fine. You, you no, can't argue with me looking like if you gonna be talking if you gonna be if you gonna be arguing. Let me at least like the way you look. I know. Once you argue with him and then like yeah, I don't like <laughs> you can't stay mad at that pretty face. You get what I'm saying? No, you cannot. No. But thank you for watching my video, it means a lot. And thank you for being in it too. Oh my god, my pleasure, Miss Director. Were you as like anxious seeing yourself on TV or no? No. Did it look no. good to you? No, I'm a savage. All you gotta say is action, <laughs> and I'm ready to act. You feel me? Okay, period. As long as you got a good producer and director, Aww. everything just flows. Like, no, I honestly enjoyed myself. Like, mm. it was a good experience, so. Thank you, boo. You're welcome. So what you about to do? What's your day look like um, today? I'm getting back into the groove of things. It feels good. I'm about to go to the grocery store, and then after that, gym, and then after that, I have my therapy session, mm -hmm. and then after that, I'm going to go get my lashes done and some whatever else I want to get done to myself today. <laughs> no, that sounds like a plan. It's yeah, my lashes so. look like spider web. They're not spider web, spider legs. Oh, girl, when I seen that in your video, like I was like cringing, like Ew. I was so scared because I I don't get like my eyelashes done so oh. I was like oh my god I hope this never happens to me because I want to experiment with that people said that's not something that just happens yeah but like I'm just thinking about all the scenarios of that happening to me the first I time know. so I'm like scared nah, I but can't I do want to like try it you know I can't lie to you like the look of lashes mm -hmm. I'm not saying I'll get cut in the eye again <laughs> but I, I, I ain't gonna give up like it looks the thing good. is that I have small eyes and I'd be feeling like if I don't have a full face makeup on, like the eyelashes, I would just look awkward because you know I have what? like a small eyelid space. I felt like, like that too. Space is small, you know? I've I've put on strip lashes without no makeup and it actually looks very stupid. When you get your lashes done, it does, it has a certain look to it for sure that even without makeup, it's still like, okay. If you want to like do lunch next week, I'm down like next weekend. Okay. That, that sounds Cause I want to look cute. You also know I don't care for weekdays either. Like there's no such difference to me than weekday and weekend. Everything is the same thing. I be working on the weekends. I be working on the weekdays. I be playing on the weekends. I be playing on the weekdays. So, you know who's fine? So random, Please. but hmm, I don't know. I don't know what this man put on me. I, I can't. I can't have peace. Who's fine? I keep thinking about him. <laughs> don't tell me the well, D guy. Excuse me. Who is saying it's fine to you? Please don't tell me what I'm thinking. Wait, how are you gonna say who are you saying and then please don't tell me? <laughs> wait, because I, I don't wanna know what you're talking about. Who are you talking about? Um, Asha K. Oh, the Latin me Asha K. Don't try to steal my man from me. Oh, the Latin me Asha K. Don't try to steal my man from me. Don't try to steal my man from me. You try, you try, you try. A lot of the me Asha K. A lot of me. He needs to work on his teeth though. That shit. What? He has gold teeth. Yeah. Wait, you like his teeth? Oh, um, like that? Um, I won't say I like them. Okay. But honestly, it's about what's on the inside, not the outside. Okay. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, so if he comes to Houston, we're going together for his concert. <laughs> now that you said you like Period. Him. I don't want anybody on his teeth, but I, I, I don't mind buying a general admission just to see my man. Nah. <laughs> like, ain't no fucking general admission. This is not that. Like, somewhere, nah. like, backstage. This is deja vu, because last night I was just, I kept saying, oh, let me, oh, let me ask that kid. But like, why are you saying my man's about, name in the middle of the night? Look, so there, we gonna have to fight. Why do all these girls want to wanna fight me over this man? Look. I've left so many guys for you, so we gonna have to. Put on <laughs> we gonna have to put on our gloves. Damn, you gotta be something. It's something. A, it's something. <laughs> something about this man. Girl. You know, I think it's just the fact that he's ghetto. Real like bad. Like a little bit ghetto. He's like that street guy. Like you, you know, get me? Real bad. Real bad. <laughs> right, anyway, let, girl. No, no, no. Exactly. Day. Look at us. Just seeing this very morning. Like, get, to, get to work. Real. All right, girl. All right, well, I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Bye. Hey, guys. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> wow. Didn't expect me to post this quickly, did you? Mm-hmm. Your fine babe is trying. Let's get to the elephant in the room because this red hair is just popping out. Come on. This one is Trouble. So shout out to Beauty Forever Hair for sending me this wig and sponsoring today's vlog. It is a frontal. It's giving like strawberry shortcake edges. Like I look like a dessert, <laughs> okay? This is not actually a red, it's um, it's linked in the description box, by the way. It's an auburn, a dark auburn. So you guys know I mess with red, but I didn't expect to mess with it like this. I'm about to be switching up my hair like this in every single video. I want to see every single version of this fine babe that there is. I like how dark the color is and the lace is kind of tinted as well. So it's not really giving like loud. It's giving very much, you know, so if your complexion is deeper than mine, I would say still try it because it would come out like a ginger color. I would just, you know, adjust the lace and everything the way you need to, but highly, highly recommend. I'm taking myself on a date today. I've been looking forward to this since last week. I told myself once I put out that final video about all that nonsense, I need to take myself on a date, okay? So that's what I'm doing today. It didn't take long at all to do the hair. It's not overly full like my wigs usually are, and I don't mind that today. It's very light on the head. It's not every day come and break my neck. So the density is decent if you're like more of like a natural look type of girl, but knowing how extra I am, I'm probably gonna dye some extra bundles and throw them in this mug. Anyway, I need to get dressed so I can meet my reservation. I have no idea what I'm gonna wear. Like, what do you actually style with red hair? I'm overthinking it. It's just me. Let's go. Um, no. I'm glad I put this on because I've had this dress for a minute and never had the confidence to wear it. And I fully had the confidence to wear it right back. Go back. Go back. Go back. Fine, babe. <laughs> But where I'm going is too much. And it's not about being extra now. Like, you dress to make yourself feel good, okay? It's about saving this for the proper, you know? Maybe, like, on a resort, just walk in and just surprise the guy. Like, ah, ah, fine, babe. Oh, yeah. Not me planning outfits for future day. But, yeah, I'm gonna go take it off. I already got a stain on it. I'm so mad. I don't even know where it is now. Yeah, like, my whole lips. This actually looks stunning. I'm glad I tried it on. I bought it like so long ago, guys, but the confidence was just... Confidence is back up, baby. Prepare to be sick of me. Prepare to be sick of me. Like, the pressure is getting worse.
So much better and so much more fitting to where I'm going. I'm going to Bloomin' Bees at the Post Oak Hotel in Uptown Houston. It's a very nice springy, brunchy spot, but we're catching lunch today. And this set is from Forever 21. I saw it, I loved the slits. It's giving classy, but you know, a little splash of razzle dazzle. And I wore it with white heels from White Fox and these Jaquemus bag. Very flowing, I love it so much let me go hurry up because these little outfit cameos be making me late <laughs> alrighty guys see y'all there Why would you assume, well, when I told you I was by myself, why would you assume I'm with somebody? You've been traumatized. Let me know when you're ready to like not be traumatized. I would just like to finish the distance so you can be single now for us. Finish what thing? I was just afraid to finish with your past now so you can focus on the new. What's going on in my past? I'm saying I was waiting for you to break up with him for me to come into your life. Oh, you're waiting for me to break up with him? I was. It's already over now, now, so I'm here. Okay, got it. I'm here now. I think I just give me say I saw you show Justin. I said just I did over now just to say yes. I said thank you very much. How how many girls have you called this week? Like to like say the same thing? But yeah, this week you say the same thing. Mm. Yeah. Me, I don't know about what you're talking about, so. Oh, you don't know what I'm talking about? Mm-mm. Okay. I don't like when niggas call me difficult and I'm being actually like really like nice. Like I'm actually like you know. No, you're actually being nice because I was very surprised when you told me I would give you that. No, I would take that away from you. I actually, I actually didn't expect you to even give me your number. I thought it would be more difficult because you were already acting difficult from day one. So, so I'm easy. I didn't say you're easy. Nobody said anything about being easy. I'm just saying. Yeah, she has it's to. Not done yet. <laughs> Don't drink it. <laughs> I'm screaming. Mm. Yummy. This is the, the one. That's like sparkling yeah. something. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you so much. I want to say bye to her. <laughs> bye, Booski. Bye, mommy. See you later. See you. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. 
Huh? Oh, thank you. Oh, alrighty. I don't want to get into my car. <laughs> These people are pursuing me, pursuing me. I wanted to say bye to her proper. You know how Africans be standing outside to talk? That's what I wanted to do. But they want to be getting people out of here. I understand. It's not even busy today. That's what I don't understand. Oh, guys, look at this cute picture I took. Let me show y'all what y'all's fine bait is up to. Okay. Can you imagine? Why is it blurry? <laughs> Ooh-wee. Yes, ma'am. Mm. I have yet to edit it, but oh my gosh. Just bomb. That was so much fun. When I mix work and play, it's like a lot less stressful. Now it's time to go home. Day. This does not matter. Makeup is still pretty. <laughs> so much fun at lunch. Let's do that. <laughs> I there's a string tied to this cover up, but I don't know where it is. I wish I didn't throw away the string. I did not. Thank you, past Sophia. I love when my past self looks out for my future self. Cause why would you throw away this string? The string was um, once attached inside, but it came out, so I just kept it. You know those strings that like go through the fabric. I literally color coordinate everything that I own. Fantastic. Both my keys to the front. I can clean this tomorrow. I can clean this tomorrow. Sorry about that guys, let me, I'm sorry guys, I'm a little bit under the influence. You don't know what you did, speak to me, get about your life, babe, speak to me. <sighs> Sometimes in life you have to just rest your head, Joy. <laughs> And don't worry about me driving. The restaurant was really like two minutes away from my place. I've been having so much fun. I've just been feeling like I'm on a cloud. Like, like God has given me a second chance at life. That's dramatic. This balcony always makes me think deeply. But it's like the way I was going about things and I'd be so like hard headed and stubborn. Like once I have my mind like set on something, nothing can change my mind. But as human beings, we like really don't know what's best for ourselves. And when life just be occurring and things be happening, like God is so intentional about stuff, right? Maybe for a reason, like entering this year, I would have never guessed by August, the end of August, yeah, you guys get the vlog tomorrow. Um, the end of August that this would be... <laughs> this would be where it's at. No. But honestly, this is exactly what I needed right now. Like, I've been praying to God and like... Just... And I just feel like in a way, even though it was the least expected way, He answered my prayers. I was talking to one of my friends. She was like, when she was going through a breakup, she was going out so much, like going to the club every night, just trying to distract herself, stay outside. But me, I took myself in this corner that you guys see me in and I thought I had time to like really think about everything and just get it, you know, out my system. And I'm glad I did, cause the sooner the mother better. Like, <laughs> I knew that I did not want to be feeling no type of way by, the end of the year. Mm -mm. There's no timeline when it comes to certain things, but uh, my dear, I said as fast as possible is the best timeline for me. As soon as possible. Let me go get my phone. I'm sure people are calling me because I have my friends meeting me at the pool. I'm going to enjoy the rest of my night and I'll see you guys in the morning. I'm being annoyed. I'm sorry. You guys don't have to deal with me like this. One more thing. When I post these pictures, when I post these pictures, like when you see this vlog, the pictures are up. Go double tap. My story be having more views than my likes on my picture. Like, how that work? These lashes are so cute. But seriously, like, go show me some love. Don't let the algorithm make me feel like bad. <laughs> bad. <laughs> 
mood I woke up today early I still have my PJs on I'm very comfy right now woke up today early cleaned my entire apartment it smells so good in here oh this is a great way to start the week I like when the scent is not like obvious it's more so like damn this place smell good and I use the Cospense scent fragrance every time my friends come they're just like what is that smell and I'm like girl girl and the scent is meant to wear but i just really love it all around me like it just smells good and it's only 40 dollars too so if you choose to buy it just let me know what you think and i'll link it down below for y'all but yeah i'm about to go and run some errands my mindset is really positive right now and i love that for me about to be in my bag for real so i need to go change okay so i keep like my whole schedule on my phone but i really need to start like using that content planner on the digital. I need to go to Apple for sure, Best Buy. I booked a last minute trip yesterday and this is gonna be my first time traveling internationally solo. Yeah, I've traveled in the United States solo multiple times, but internationally to a different country solo, I don't know if I should make it a surprise or just say where I'm going. I think it's fun when it's a surprise, you know, like, <laughs> I'm so excited. Like I said yesterday, I'm trying to get to know myself and I'm being intentional about that. So just getting out of my comfort zone and putting myself in a different situation and it's gonna be fun. So vlogging will keep me occupied for sure and save all these memories. I need to go and get a selfie stick because I'll be taking my own pictures. I'm nervous for that guys, like it's making my heart beat right now. I need my pictures and it's all up to me. I don't even know how to do the whole Bluetooth thing, but I need to figure it out. I need to get more SD cards. I just need to go and time is going. I want to get out before it starts raining because Houston is in this rainy season right now and it is so annoying. But yeah, I don't really like rainy weather when I'm trying to be productive. It just makes me not want to do anything. I know you guys like love me and stuff, but are disappointed in how much I don't post. So I'm trying to change my, what is it called? The reputation? Yeah, like I've always wanted to be that consistent YouTuber that's posting every week, but it just never worked out. It's always the one thing after the other, but the amount of peace I have in my life right now, like, <laughs> you know how things can be going too well. And it's just like, my rough season was very long. So I'm very much embracing this long, peaceful season for as long as it lasts. Thank you. 
have a dewy finish on my face. I just don't want to mess up my hair if I'm not wearing it, you know. People are texting me like crazy today. So, I like today. Which one do you guys like better? I'm really just going to run errands. I'm just taking my card holder. I don't need this like, you know, big bag. So small bag it is. Someone said Sophia in black clothes. Half the clothes in my closet is black. I just like wearing black. And I don't see a problem with it, okay? If I don't wanna wear any other color, I don't wanna wear any other color. Right? It just looks so like put together, classy, clean. Speaking of clean, I wanna wear a fragrance. Let me go put that on real quick. This is like my favorite fragrance to wear every, ooh. Valentino Born in Roma. Like, I just like feeling clean and put together. And you never know who you're gonna see, especially living in like Uptown Houston. You wanna look good. You wanna leave your house like feeling good, looking fresh, you know? So, let me go before they close. I dropped my camera so hard just now. I thought my camera was done for. Whew, I gotta be more careful. And I'm hungry, I need to go home so I just have one more stop. drop oh my god this is so annoying okay oh my god it's hot oh jesus texas wants to kill somebody <sighs> tell me why i came out the wrong door and i ended up walking three floors down the garage now i easily could have turned around and went into the elevator. But I was like, you know what? I need to get some activity in today. Get my body flowing, whatever. I don't even have water, this is crazy. Yeah, like I feel heat to my chest. Anyway, so I find myself walking down this garage three floors. It got to a point where I was too far from any door and I just had to keep going. Like, <laughs> now that I'm back to my car, like what? <laughs> Never doing that nonsense again. I need to get a tripod so that as I'm driving, I can still, you know, be vlogging. I've always been like afraid to have red hair again, like on an everyday basis, not just for like a look because I just don't feel like it's a natural hair color, but this red is so calm. Like you just see how it just like looks calm and I've been getting compliments on my hair like all day which is really cool if I try to leave my camera balancing up there it's definitely gonna fall I wish it'll be nice to see me drive <laughs> see how I, I handle myself see how I yay I just thank god this car be beeping for every unnecessary reason because the amount of nonsense I would have done in my car if not <laughs> dramatic lashes and red hair on a weekday who am I and it's not giving ghetto <laughs> Okay, so first things first, I have this iPad since Christmas, right? And I haven't used it. I just didn't know what an iPad is supposed to be used for. I just felt like as a content creator, I should have one. But that's the reason why I went to Apple today and got a, what is it called? And a pencil. <laughs> it's called a pencil. It retails for $129 plus tax. And I'm actually going to use it now, so I might as well unbox it. Bye bye. Apple's always difficult to open. That's what it looks like. Oh. Okay. And then um, 
And then I just got my Bath and Body Works. It was right across the Apple Store, hard to miss. And I got a whole bunch of like soaps, of course, and bath washes. I ended up getting these two bath washes because I'm trying to take a nice bath tonight. And um, when I tell you like a whole bunch of <laughs> hand sanitizers, and I'm gonna put them in different um, purses, but I want this one to have the What's the warm vanilla? Is it both the same thing with different? I got both the same thing with different covers, girl. Yeah, that one can go in there. But yeah, I'm gonna just put them in different purses so that I always have hand sanitizer on the go. With all this stuff going around, guys, I don't want no parts. So I'm gonna go set up the iPad and the iPencil, or the Apple Pencil, whatever it's called, um, and just get it set up for the week and plan out my month in September and October. I always plan two months ahead. It just makes me feel like prepared for life and also know when to schedule brand sponsorships and travel when I need to or take off days or hang out with friends, just structure, which I need right now. And then after that, I'm gonna read my devotional. I actually wanted to read it with y'all, but I be taking my time to study it. It's already like late afternoon and I want this video out in a couple of hours. And that's gonna mean me editing like this. So I'm gonna edit this vlog and then read my devotional before going to bed. And oh, the vlog is ending. <laughs> um, let me know if you guys will want me to do my devotional with y'all in one vlog, maybe my next one. I know everybody that watches my vlogs is not necessarily like Christian or religious or whatever, but I appreciate y'all watching me anyway. But for my girls that are, let me know if you'd be interested in reading and studying my devotional with me in my next vlog. I would actually love to do that with you all. Like, I read the devotional by myself and it's super good. It's called God What The Heck. You guys have seen it in my previous vlogs already. It's what helped me get over this like season really good and, and what's even keeping me going and striving right now. So if you want it for yourself, it's in my Amazon store, but if you'd like to study it together in my next vlog, comment down below and let me know. And if there's enough comments about it, then I will include it in my next vlog. I just wasn't sure as well with this vlog. But anyway, that ends this vlog. I hope you guys, I always check myself out before I leave. <laughs> This vlog was mad simple, you know, regular, regular, regular day. But I thought I don't have to be coming and doing foo, 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 every upload. Like I can really just chill and spend time with you guys casually. It's not every time come and die or cry. <laughs> Once again, thank you to Beauty Forever for sponsoring this video. And I will see you guys in my next video, which is uploading very soon as well. Because your girl is a consistent queen. Bye. <laughs>